Ahoy there. Today I'm going to review the Sports Royale's Power Tower Dip Station Pull Up Bar for home gym strength training workout equipment, which is being sold on Amazon for 250 Canadian dollars plus tax. When I first bought it, uh, which was back in January of 2022, um, it was $240 plus tax, which came to $271, and the price went up $10 since then. Anyways, let's get to the power tower itself. So the box was pretty heavy to move, but not only that, it was really huge. So it was very difficult to move even a short distance and bring it inside. I don't know how the delivery guy brought in all, all the way up the stairs, but good job for him. And I, had a, I was struggling with it. So the unboxing took quite a while. Uh, everything was packed very tightly and it took a while to unwrap everything and take everything apart. The assembly was very straightforward. You, you just have to screw these screws and nuts here, as you can see here. And I just want to say that the power tower, the lowest height is actually 77.18 inches. The, that's the lowest setting that you can set it to. The 64.56 inches is just for storage and it's just hanging there. It's not set in place. The dip bars are surprisingly tall and my feet don't touch the ground when I'm using them. I mean, I can barely touch them when I'm tiptoeing. I'm about 5'7", 170 centimeters, and the pull-up bar is high enough for me at 77.18 inches, which is its lowest setting. The grips are made of rubber, which are not super soft, but they are more durable than the foam ones. So I guess it, that is a trade-off. I use a towel on top of it to keep it clean and also to add a bit more cushion. So into the actual review of the pull-up tower, it makes shaking noises when you're using it, as you can hear here, but it's stable enough. Uh, the shaking noises are mostly from the dip bars. The dip bars are the ones that are shaking and making the noises. The tower itself is actually quite stable. I took out the back cushion, as you can see in this video, because it gets in the way of the pull-ups. My back was scraping against it. The foot bar gets in the way, so you have to be careful. Um, I hurt my heel once when landing hard uh, when I lost my balance, but otherwise I keep my feet forward and that keeps me from getting injured at all. So you just have to be mindful of your feet position when you're landing because you could hurt your heel like I did once. The previous pull-up bar that I used damaged the paint and door frame because it was one of those pull-up bars that expanded more to the sides as you pulled down on it. And that's why I bought this pull-up bar to stop damaging the door frame and paint. I gave it five stars on Amazon. It gets the job done. Other than the bad positioning of the foot bar and the back cushion getting in the way of pull-ups a little bit, I have no complaints and it works very well. So that's it for my review of the Sports Royale's Power Tower Dip Station pull-up bar. Thanks for watching and have a good night.